before I became a lawyer and a law professor, many years ago in the 1960s and early 70s, I was in an organization called the Black Panther Party for Self-Defense. My husband was one of the earliest members. His name was Eldridge Cleaver, and he was their Minister of Information. He left the United States as a fugitive and went to Cuba, and I joined him in Algeria and spent many of my years in the Black Panther Party out of the country. Back in 1967 and 68, I lived in Atlanta. I was an activist with the Student Nonviolent Coordinating Committee. In the era from the Freedom Movement into the Black Power Movement, was a place that I was very tied to. There was an earlier documentary series that Professor Henry Louis Gates had produced about the history of black America from the earliest days to the present, and the episode that he shot about the late 60s was so popular and so intense, he was actually asked to expand that, and he's now done And Still I Rise, which is a four to five part series about that era. I was filmed in Oakland, California, where the Black Panther Party had started and interviewed there uh, at some of the original sites, like the courthouse where we demonstrated. And so that was my participation in the expansion of the story of the late 60s to give more detail to the story of the Black Panther Party, which I was an early member of.